comes out and there's no more news, then, you know, it will suddenly go down because everybody will sell. That's just BS, man. It's just completely BS. It's better than a stable point coin. It's a stable coin that keeps going up. I'm actually surprised. It was half a dollar. Now it's more than $3. Are you still sitting on the back and saying like, oh, it's going to go down one day. It's going to go down one day. How much do you have to see to actually, you know, like, like how much do you have to see it go up before you realize that you're, 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 you're just in your own head? It's just, it's just crazy. It's just insane. It's like, how much more does it have to go up? Like, I find it so... I find it so sad that people that have the ability, you know, to just ride the waves to the fucking moon, right? Just sitting there, like doing a nine to five job or whatever the fuck, right? While they could just, you know, easy peasy. Yeah, it's just like a stable coin is worse. Let me tell you something, Bernie. You say like stable coin. Let me tell you, Tether, right? They just print out of nothing, nothing backed up. If they get, if they have to pay up everyone, right? They're just like, they, they just, it's titter, just crashes. It's gone. It's like, it's just like, so like a stable coin is not stable either with your logic. It's just tether, it's just, you know, like exactly the same thing. It's not a stable point. Then stable coins don't even exist. No, because if they, if everybody goes tomorrow and says, I want my dollars for my tether, they cannot provide it. It will just crash. They can't provide it. They, these guys, these execs and stuff are riding Lamborghinis. Huh? Same with fiat. Yes, yeah, same with fiat. But that's the thing. Like, it's like when, 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 you, when you start going to, into, the, into the alley of, you know, like, oh, yeah, this and that. It's like the only thing that you can literally... Uh, 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 point out to is if uh, like within within a, f a framework of where everything is possible is just the track record and it just keeps going up that's it so yeah but i just i'm just surprised like because he was there he's been there from the beginning when it was half a dollars and now it's more than three dollars and he's just sitting there. So oh, yeah. You can just sit there, I mean, like, and, and miss out. I mean, that's your life. You're going to just cry. That's it. But I wonder if it's even him. Because I wouldn't be surprised it's just a hater taking his name. Because I, I wouldn't be surprised it was the same with... Uh, um, that it's the same with, what is it called? Um, the same with uh, Jinx. I wonder if it's even him. Wouldn't be surprised it's not even him. Actually, I wouldn't be surprised it's not him. Asterisk, don't be so aggressive. A team is not even talking bullshit. Nah, man. Like you gotta, you gotta read between the lines, bro. You gotta read between the lines. So yeah. Bro, what about what you did to Yashik? I don't know what I believe him. I had a personal convo with him. He got all his money back. That's it. He was going around saying that I scammed him, that I scammed him. Should I just gave him all his fucking money back, including the donations to charity. It really costed us more than, why well, it costed us 5K. So yeah. Yeah, but what about the 20K purpose? In his head, like, the thing is, though, what you have to know, right? Is if you go around, right, calling us scammers and uh, saying you're going to lose your money and everything, 
Like the reason why people are basically banking on purpose is because they trust me and that's it. It's like, it's all at the end of the day, it's a trust relationship. If you don't trust me and you go around talking bullshit, I just give you a fucking donation back and that's it. If you don't like that, you don't get purpose. It's like, this is so damaging for our efforts and everything. Like he's in a stronger position calling as a scammer when he's holding purpose and has, you know, donated than if he would have gotten all his donation back. Since he got his donation back, he doesn't, didn't call us once anymore uh, scammers because he got all his, he, all his donation back, all his money. So yeah, it's, it's, so about this or that. When games come out and people are more open to selling, probably because price increases 10x, there will be 20 orders below supply wall and it will feel like a free market. Therefore, price can drop too and not just only go up. It will become volatile just like Bitcoin. No, that's not true because you don't have, like getting 4% return for locking purpose is, 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 is what keeps it going up. It's like what you're saying is like, oh yeah, it's going to go down, going to go, that, that doesn't even, that doesn't even uh, apply to purpose and doobie because it's the lock mechanic. It's like if you can get, let's say purpose, purpose can only do, drop like uh, very little because it's always then like the more that it drops, the more it becomes profitable to lock and get the interest out of it instead. So, yeah. That didn't answer my question. Atini could have made a lot more money when you guys forced him to sell below what he could have made. You guys contacted him to sell before it blew. He shouldn't have gone around and said that we are scammers. And saying that, you know, he, he, we, we scammed him. We just gave him his fucking donation back. I don't know what you're talking about. I, I don't even know if you're a legit person or just some random guy with, with his name. It doesn't make any sense. Like, he got all his money back. That's it. It's like, who, who can even, you know, like, it doesn't, you know... It doesn't make any sense what you are saying. It's like it didn't lose any money. But yeah, if you understand that, then yeah. Then you get it. I'm just going off what him and his guys are saying. Well, yeah, like he got his donation back and that's it. We li like like w the situation with Jasik, it's actually the other way around. I got robbed by him in a sense because the money he gave to save the children, we ended up paying it out of our pocket. He can really not complain. At the moment, taking risks money-wise is kind of scary. How much is sensible amount of money to invest in the platforms of Bitcoin? Once again, could you explain what it is all about? If not, I can watch a video about it and link in the chat. Purpose is just the, the, the crypto coin I, I like that I used for the game and everything. So, yeah. So what's up with the dis Discord group he made just for haters? He makes notes on you after party exposing you guys. Man, it's just some fucking, I think it's quite some nice popcorn. I don't even care. Yeah. Purpose is really the most crazy thing on the internet. It's the most crazy crypto. Purpose and Doobie is by far the most crazy shit. And I find it actually baffling that people are not making, taking advantage of it. It's going to be really sad. It's going to be really sad. When shit hits the fan and people look back and start crying and begging to get it cheaper. You know what? Uh, you know what's going to happen, right? I'm telling now already, like, mark my words. People are going to come in the Discord and ask other people, like, hey... I heard a lot of people here are millionaires. I need money and start coming with sob stories. Like mark my words, this is what's going to happen. And people coming as, you know, disguised as girls and whatever with sob stories saying like, yeah, yeah, I couldn't get purpose when I was there or they make new accounts or whatever the fuck. Just get yourself some sweet ass purpose and, you know, live the bay life.
there should be a neutral space like Wikipedia where haters and fans sit together and really try to be as neutral pos as possible. Uh, when will purpose be on Binance? Pfft, I don't care. Like Binance, if you want, if we want to be on Binance, we just pay 200k, and then we're on Binance. But I don't care about Binance. Like they will just purpose will never be on Binance. When when the volume of DBX goes through the roof, right, and millions and millions go through DBX, they will just they won't give a shit. If Clash of Stream is on the news in the crypto, right? And really being, you know, praised by even people like Vitalik and stuff, I fucking guarantee it's gonna happen, right? Then they will just put it immediately. Cause you think they care about fucking crypto check or whatever the fuck they just care about fucking money, man. I was pissed because I bought a lot of purpose. And how much, where is your purpose? And I had to sell it for cheap. Oh, you fucking, you're a fucking idiot, man. You got yourself talked into by fucking haters and you just now have to justify your stupid mistake. That's really fucking self-wrecked, man. And then you turn into a hater? Come on, man. Okay, that explains why you're acting like the way you act. Just take the losses and get yourself purpose before you start crying even more when it keeps going up. And next time, think for yourself and don't believe some random guy on the internet. Look at track records. That's really funny. But that's really fucking funny, though. That's why he keeps coming back and keeps saying this fucking story. It's because he sold for cheap. And now he sees it keep going up and he feels more and more like shit. Oh, that's so fucking, yeah. Next time, know who to trust. That's really fucking funny, though. <laughs> Actually, that makes it. I'm a lot less fucking. <laughs> I just think this is fucking funny. You're just a loser now, man. <laughs> yeah, you were trying to get the facts right from a random guy on the internet, and then you sold cheaper. Like, maybe you can ask, you know, can, maybe you can ask Yashik to give you th the difference back. Let's see if he does that. Well, talk your well, long term fine. Fuck you, man. You go on fucking uh, Twitch chat calling me a blackmailer and a scammer. Just go fuck yourself, man. Be happy that I don't just fucking ban you. You go around spreading lies because you have to make up because you fucking missed out because you fucking believe some random fucking loser on the internet. Seriously, man. That's your own fucking fault. Take responsibility and take it like a fucking man. Unfucking believable, man. This is the real team for you. Fuck, bro. Like, man, you get the fuck out, man. Mr. Bernie, I don't give a shit. Like, fucking wannabe fucking haters disguised as people that came over here because they think they have more fucking authority in this court. This is the fucking after party, man. You don't like it? You get the fuck out, man. This is not Twitch. I can say whatever the fuck I want. So, yeah. I think don't get mad about some random people talking about it. This is just a show. So, yeah. Oh yeah, I'm gonna go a little on a little band spree. Get the fuck out. Get the fuck out. There you go, man. All the losers gone. <laughs> who's gonna cry? Who, who is who's who, who is crying because the, the, the losers are gone? Who's who's crying? But that's actually really funny. The guy kept coming back. The guy kept book like the guy kept coming back because he sold cheaper. That is like, but you get this. I can't even make this shit up. It's really he he bought it went up. He he saw a fucking shitty story. He got himself talked into by some bunch of haters to sell. He sold for less, and he keeps seeing it go up. Then comes starts saying like, "Yeah, you're a blackmailer. You're a scammer. Get the fuck out, man." And I've seen that the biggest haters, right, are not the ones that, you know, lost money on Doobie, are the ones that actually sold and have to justify afterwards. These are the biggest haters. Uh, serious, you're not trying to hear, but it's not allowed to advertise. Um, 
crypto in uh, in Twitch. It is allowed, but for whatever reason, I got banned. I really like that picture there, by the way. <laughs> uh, I got banned because fucking live stream trail uh, live stream fail thread. Remember, people, Athena is not scamming you when you buy purpose. You are scamming yourself because you didn't get a key yet. Yeah, like everybody's getting scammed, man. I mean, people love to get scammed, Party Bay. Who wants to join the scam? Say it in the chat. Who love, like, who, who is enjoying the scam? I'm scamming everyone every day, all the time, all the time. They're loving it. They're asking me to scam them. It's, it's, a, it's you know, it's a, what do you call it? It's a, man, I fucking love being able to just, Shit on these fucking haters. On Twitch, I can't do this. This is the best. They are loving Yeah, They have Stockholm syndrome. They're just fucking idiots. They're stupid. They're morons. They just, you know, they want to get scammed. They're too far gone. Who is going to get themselves even more to get scammed even more? Say it in the, say it in the Discord. Who is joining the scam, guys? Who is going to get scammed even more? Milking these fucking losers. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. <laughs> yeah. Who's going full, full all in? Get scammed. Yeah, who wants to get on some proper scam? Let's go, man. This is, by the way, why I got banned on Twitch. Because of this. Because <laughs> I was just telling people I was scamming them. And then they fucking clipped it. And then they said, look, there's proof. He said it. He said it on the stream as if if I was a fucking scammer, I would say it in people's face. Are you crazy? If I was an actual fucking scammer, I would go around saying like, I'm scamming you. Give me your money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's really going to work. Don't you believe it was possible to convince this Amur guy rather than letting the Banhammer speak? I wasn't sure if he spe really was a hater or just confused and talked to the wrong people. Astraeus, man, honestly, it's a good show. I don't really care so much. It's like, you might wonder like, yeah, but like, it's just an after party. I mean, people come, they go. It's just a fucking show, man. You think in reality, I go around yelling and all that shit and banning people. I just am introvert, just doing my shit, you know, working my ass off. I don't care about any of this shit. It's just like, okay, people get banned, people get unbanned all the time. It's just nice entertainment. How much time do I have left to buy? Go, the faster the better. I'm afraid it does more damage to you. How? It's the internet, man. Nobody gives a shit. It's really the internet and nobody gives a shit. Hurry up. Red, how much? Eight K. Eight K purpose or eight K dollars? Dollars, I see. Yeah, hurry up, man. That's all I can say. It's strength is purpose one and you just lost one guy, but I don't mind purpose one. These guys are the ones that, you know, like if they were doing the troll of Jenks, right? They just fucking pumped purpose four levels. They come here, they are in their little party, just laughing, biffling. They're just doing literally my bidding. Hating is also doing my bidding. Like it's promoting what I do. It's talking about me. I, I like them. I, I actually really like them. They're doing a good job. Even Yashik, you know, it's cool what he does. He, he, he makes these videos every time, every after parties on his channel and stuff. I mean, like other people would just not even have the time to do that. It's like if you are fueled with hate, right? Or whatever, right? You're so much more driven to do stuff and it and and, and it causes talk yashik is, is also was a big fan maybe still is partly it's just like he fucked up and i do even think part of him he knows he went too far with calling it all a scam and going to youtube comments and saying yeah this guy is a scammer it's really it's not cool what he did it's really not cool the guy was literally sitting on forty thousand dollars right out of 10k and he was just a, a voice of hate saying that i was scamming scamming i had to give his donation back he was like i don't even know if like if people were saying like yeah you got you made four times your money so i don't even know if i'm gonna make the money maybe a thing's gonna take it all away and i will have nothing 
It's like, well, yeah, then you just get your fucking donation back and you don't even have to be afraid anymore. I just see so much BS in the Chris docu and I think on some level it really hurts Peter Person. <laughs> Astraios, this Chris docu will actually strengthen us. Watch the next documentary, man. Like this is actually like what happened with the Chris docu and all the shit that happened afterwards will just be some of the biggest, you know, PR boost for Clash of Streamers. You like the 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 key in life, right? is to really build on your strengths and turn your weaknesses in a strength too. There's a lot of weaknesses, right, that you can turn into strengths. It's like when I got banned on Twitch, right, that's a big weakness. What did I do? I turned it into a strength. I just made my own platform. It's like in life, you always got to turn your weaknesses into strength or try to. So like even the Chris Doku, it's actually, yeah, like... It just shows, it shows a vulnerability and it makes you stronger. Tim, what do you think about people like Jordan Peterson or Sam Harris? I don't think so much about it. Tell them some about the game. The game's coming out soon. We're working our ass off and uh, it's actually gonna go bananas. It's going to go bananas. Will purpose be available in regular crypto markets? I don't know, but I wouldn't be surprised actually that it will happen. I need money. Please help me. Yeah. I know you're trolling, but a lot of people will start doing that. Also, purpose is doing really well. Working your ass of playing WoW for a month. Well, yeah, it's to promote the game. Huh? And it's working quite nice. Yeah, man, like it's really crazy how much purpose and another 3K got, got, man, it's really crazy how much purpose. There's a lot of volume. I don't troll. I really need money. I don't have. Erila Zronin, why don't you find a job? Krypton is just a currency in the game and not an actual currency. No, Krypton is just a digital currency in the game that allows you to export. I can't work because it got brainwashed. Okay. Man, purpose is such a fucking gift. Money, huh? Are you still have it planned to have offline mode for the game on launch? We already have offline mode, of course. The entire infrastructure is offline mode. How do you get purpose if it's not Coinbase? You can get it on DBX. Someone can link it. We have, you know, our, our own exchange. Doesn't it make it easily hackable offline? Nope, because we work with seeds that sync with the server. And if the seeds don't match, then you get reverted. What is your prediction on the price by the end of the year, conservative? After a year of launch, between 20 and 500 bucks or something, maybe a hundred, but no promise, of course. I think a hundred, even more. I think even more than a hundred. Are you worried about people making private service for COS? Uh, how would that work? I don't even think that's possible. But I'm not worried about it at all. 
Yeah, but reverse engineering the backend, it's much more than that. Yeah, but Idle Heroes is a shitty, simple game. So, yeah. But to Arilas Ronin, uh, I'm sorry, man. Like, I think you'd have more success if you'd be begging outside, you know? Uh, like, then here on a fucking random Discord. And also the way you do it, it's like, it, it won't work. At least create a sob story or something. It's like just saying, like, I need money, I need money. You just get banned on Discords. I would remove the playback jack part though. Yeah, get yourself free, oh, not free purpose, but get yourself purpose. A tin, yeah, a little too risky, by the way, low. I have blackjack, yeah. What story do you want to hear? Why don't you just apply and come over? Eri Lazaronin. Is the money you guys make on purpose for charity get rich or a bit of both? Um, we are just all philanthropists, altruists. Well, at least me and Reese are. I hope you shut those haters mouth with the release. Actually, David 17, I think my my vibe might change a lot with launch. <clears throat> uh How many cards left? <clears throat> it's not so accurate, but it went a little bit up, a little bit up though, but it's not accurate. Oh, still says 600. <laughs> it still says 600. That's weird. It was higher earlier. Wait, let me refresh. It said 800 earlier, but now it's back to 600. So, yeah. There will be two more betas on release before release. But the, the second one will be very quick after the first one. They might even be simultaneous. Well, one day in between. I mostly get the vibe that people like chilatine more most of the times. Well, chilatine and trolatine. Yes and no, Astraeus. If I'm all the time chill, my views go down like crazy, for real. It's, it's the balance. You need some cocktail combo. It's like if every time you go to the after party and I'm always just chill, gajil, people would just not, you know, go in it. But if I start yelling and fucking ban random people and talking schmack, it's just like, oh, what's going to happen today? Just you gotta you gotta present a, a wide dish, not every day the same. Where are where do you live, Erilaz Ronin? Where do you live? Germany. You gotta go to the government, man. If you're a drugs addict, you've got to go to the government. There is rehab facilities and everything. Germany has one of the best healthcare system in the world. Just, you know, seek help and... Yeah, you don't need 400 euros per month. You, 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 need, you, need, you need rehab, I think. Tim, why don't you just open a school in Morocco instead of trying to save the world by making an app? 
a school in Morocco. Are you fucking crazy? Why the fuck would I do that? As if schools do even a lot. Do you think people who run ad campaigns for their referral links can make profits? Yes. I think so, yes. I'm actually quite certain of it. I actually think one of the best ways for streamers to grow initially with zero money is to put money in an ad campaign and get a, a, a small community going. Because you run ads, you have a small community going and you do giveaways and everything. You can literally, with a very simple system, just grow. Where do I find my referral link? Bottom left after you added your face. Did you connect already? If you connect any platform, you instantly get redirected to add your face and shit. How much do you get if you refer people? You get 20% of all their purchases in progress, 10% sent to your game and 10% sent to your gaming for good dashboard. On the gaming for dashboard, you can give out these gems and, and Krypton for either donations or subscriptions or for follows you choose. Oh, so it's actually a buy wall. So where the doobie in the buy wall come from? Can you explain? Can it be mined? Is it pre mined and hold it by you? Like for example, Ripple, you lock the purpose that give that the, the 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 action of locking your purpose is was what gives you doobie and then you can sell that doobie into the buy wall it's the locking of the purpose that creates the doobie you get it so initially there was zero doobie but as people started locking their purpose it created doobie that they could sell into the buy wall some people decided to buy doobie at overpriced prices but yeah Can a normal guy without a following like me use referrals to turn them into hard cash? If so, how? So Cole, the way I would do it, right, is I would run ads, get people to come, start streaming, saying like, man, you guys, you know, join my ad, whatever the fuck, because, you know, like, because having this personal ads is really cool. Like seeing a game, seeing an ad and seeing the guy in the ad saying like, hey, try this game, you'll be in my community. I would already have some kind of connection. You just entertain them. You make sure, like, if you get one whale, he will just basically fund your ability to start a big following. Well, that's the way to stream, yeah. What you can also do without streaming is just you get many people to go into your community. And, uh, yeah, like, you just hope they stay in your community and they spend money. But I don't know how, like, yeah, maybe. Ah, the way I would do it making money is... I would just trade on the auction house or on the blockchain. I would just trade. That's how I would make money. I'm pretty sure the biggest communities will be titty streamers on Twitch. Man, girls are going to make so much money with, oh my God. It's like, I really think it's first, as crazy as it sounds, girls are first going to make Clash of Streamers blow up. So I get referrals, they spend, I get 20%. I trade on the auction house with that money, cash out to hard cash. No, the way it works is what I would do is I don't, you don't even need the referrals. I would just, you know, be smart about selling and buying skins on the auction house, exporting uh, season one skins to the blockchain and then hold them and then sell them once they go up in value. That's what I would do. I would really get a lot of season one skins on launch. Yeah, I discussed the beta. We can we can have a beta next week or a bit later. It depends how much we want in it. Bitcoin is a decentralized currency relying on blockchain technology. What about purpose? It's also a decentralized currency relying on blockchain technology, except that uh, I can mint as much as I want. 
I can create as much as I want, but I'm not allowed to sell because the moment I sell, it becomes a security and I go to jail. It's just like Ethereum. It's a ERC-20 token, yeah, that will be used in our game as well. Basically, Clash of Streamers, you can get anything. You can get 30% more value with Purpose or Doobie in Clash of Streamers through Gaming for Good. There is a shop. You can check it out. So, yeah. I wish you had some kind of referral system with hard cash. I would market the shit out of your game. Cold, that would be actually illegal, just so you know. What you're saying there would not be allowed. It's literally against TOS and everything. And it's also legally, you know, that's why we have all this. I do, do affiliate marketing for casinos, very similar concept. What's the difference? They have a, a they have a they have a license. And uh they also don't have apps on uh on Google or nor uh and uh Apple. They don't have any apps. So yeah. Good night, man. I'm gonna go soon as well in four minutes. Yeah. Man, the chat is so much nicer since these two fuckers got banned. You gotta admit it's really night and day difference. And then people say like, man, man, man. Don't uh, don't ban people. It's not good. It's not good. It's minus EV. It's not minus EV, man. It's really good. Makes the vibe so much better. So what's the difference between sponsoring someone on YouTube, for example, and paying them a percent of conversions and then direct affiliate marketing? Like when there is real money involved, right? Uh, there's an entire different leg legal framework and depending on country and where people are, it's just you, things become much more legally uh, problematic. While if it is a donation system and it's all just more volunteerish, then the law is much more lax. So it depends, it depends. It's, yeah. There should really be a Q&A or something on DBX explain the whole purpose thing exactly. Can someone link the Q&A? There is a Q&A here. That's a fan that made that site. You happy, homie? Mr. Ghost Knight? So yeah, I'm going to be calling it a day. Huh? But yeah, people make sure to look into this purpose stuff. The game is coming out really soon and you guys are going to really cry if you don't get yourself some nice sweet purpose. And uh, yeah, for the rest, um, everything is going good. People can show the videos and uh, the exchange. People that want to apply here, people that want to try at the game here. And um, yeah, I'll, uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Get that sweet purpose or you're going to really cry for real. Peace out.